This video is for the owners of properties with an indoor residential vapour mitigation system installed by the South Australian Environment Protection Authority. Indoor vapour mitigation systems are installed to prevent vapour such as TCE, present in contaminated groundwater, from migrating up through the soils and into the indoor air. There are various types of vapour mitigation systems available. The system operates by extracting air from within the building's crawl space or beneath the building's slab and vent the vapour to atmosphere. This design has proven to be effective in successfully reducing indoor air concentrations of vapour to safe levels. Key components of the vapour mitigation system include a network of extraction pipes beneath the flooring, an enclosed extraction fan located on the outside of the building and a monitoring and alarm panel to monitor the system. The monitoring panel displays the status of the system. This is a typical monitoring panel, showing the system status and vacuum pressure. The two LEDs show the system status. If the green light is on, the system is working. If the red light is on, there may be a problem with the system and you must contact the EPA. You should regularly check this panel to make sure your system is operating correctly. While working, the system will continue to reduce vapours to safe levels in the building. Once the system is installed, tested and working correctly, the system will reduce the concentrations of vapour in the indoor air to safe levels. To ensure the system continues to operate as expected, the owner must comply with an environmental performance agreement they signed prior to installation. The system is quiet, economical to run and requires very little maintenance. Further information on your system, including maintenance and troubleshooting, is provided in your Vapour Mitigation System Operator Manual. If you cannot locate your Operator Manual, please contact the EPA so that another copy can be provided to you.